welcome back to my channel. Hopefully there's not too much of an echo because I am in a bathroom right now. But the reason I am in this bathroom is because I am bringing you guys a hair video. <laughs> One of the things that apparently really stand out about me ever since I cut it is my hair. Um, I did do the big chop back in April. And I've cut it a few times ever since then, but now I'm trying to grow it out. Um, so I can get me some braids for the fall, winter time. Um, but yeah, so there's a few people that I can also think of off the top of my head who have also done the big chop this summer. Um, a lot of girls have done it. So I figure why not help everybody out and give y'all five hairstyles that I like to do on my short curly hair. Um, just if y'all want to mix it up or whatever especially while it's in its awkward stage so yeah we're gonna get right into it please do not forget to subscribe comment like share ring that bell so you can receive all of my post notifications and follow me on all my social media it's going to be in the description box below why because you're popping i'm popping and we should all be popping together period all right, so let's get right into it. So right now, I'm just stretching out my hair. I'm going to get a spray bottle, spray my curls, get the water through. I'm using Design Essentials, their little curling product. going to get that through my hair. The main priority is to scrunch, 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 scrunch those curls, get them together. I'm going to use Gorilla Snot Gel uh, to do my edges. Cause it just gotta be popping period and that is the first look i call this the curly fro with baby hairs get into it get into it and it's gonna take us right into our second look which is really just the same thing but i put a part in it you can put a part on either side um make sure it's nice and clean my hair got frizzy so i just sprayed the frizz out and I'm gonna just scrunch up my curls some more. I brush down the side to define my part. Yes, yes, yes. Scrunch, I use a wide tooth comb to get some more volume. I love this style, like this is my go-to style nowadays now that my hair's gotten longer. And well, bam, I call this one the put a part in it. All right, so. For this next style, you're gonna put a part on both sides and you don't want it to be super defined or neat. So I'm kind of just messily pulling it apart. You're gonna wet your brush, brush down your sides and the back and keep your the top still, you know, curly and voluminous. It's kind of like a mohawk, but not really. I'm using the Nairobi and some jam to help smooth it down. I use that jam mostly in the back of my head, really. Now that my hair's gotten longer, it's hard for my curls to stay down in the back. I'm using some Gorilla Gel too. I don't have any Eco Styling Gel, so that's why I'm using the Gorilla Snot Gel. It's pretty strong. You're gonna keep brushing it until it's smooth, and then you're gonna take a small comb and some more than Nairobi. And basically what I'm doing is I'm finger waving the sides, but because my hair is so long, I can't do it super neat. And I was running out of product out of the Nairobi. So I couldn't slick it down as much as I want to, but hopefully you guys can get the gist. Like I'm I'm doing finger waves, but they're, they're messy finger waves, basically. So yeah, that side looked more defined. That's cute. Yeah, you cute girl, you cute, you cute. <laughs> yes okay and you're really just gonna just play around with it um get your desired look of course i'm gonna go in with the edge brush and fix up my edges this is honestly what makes this hairstyle like whenever i do this hairstyle i always go crazy on the edges which is something that not a lot of people prefer all the time but i really like it when i'm doing this and i get a lot of compliments so yeah i just play around with it do different curls for my baby hairs mess with it until i'm satisfied and well bam I call this one the hybrid because it's a mix between finger waves and the curly fro. Yes, ma'am. 
all right so this next one you're going to take your brush and you're going to smooth your hair down my hair is really fine so it's pretty easy for me to smooth it down but my curls don't always like to stay but yeah you're gonna take water and just brush 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 so it's slick then you're gonna take some Nairobi and help to slick that down some more then you're gonna take some Gorilla Snot Gel. Like I said, honestly, I would use Eco Styling Gel, but this is all I had. I would not use this all over your head, but I had to do what I had to do. Brush it down some more. Y'all see it slick? Y'all see my little peanut head? <laughs> and then I'm just playing around with it just so that it's not super slick. Like I like to have, you know, a little bit of texture, you know? And here I'm just doing my baby hairs, of course. I'm doing them super neat. And then I brush down any hair that got, you know, frizzy, any flyaway curls. And what bam, this is called Pimp Name Slickback. <laughs> yes. All right, so now we're gonna put a part into what we just did for this next style. And um, this next style, you're gonna see as I get into it, what I'm trying to do here, but it's kind of like what I said when I was doing the hybrid, I did not have a lot of foam. Pretty much this was all I had left of my Nairobi bottle. And then my hair is super long now. So what I do is I do finger waves in the front and I just slick down the back. I don't even worry about the back. Um, I just wave the front as best as I can. So hopefully you guys can see that. get into it and that is that style all right and because i love you guys so much i'm going to give you one more style i'm actually going to use a head wrap for this one so i'm just going to twist 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 and then you're going to twist it as if you're twisting a bun and just stick that part right on in Tuck it under. <laughs> I was struggling a little. <laughs> All right. Adjust it to your liking so it doesn't hurt your ears or anything like that. And then, of course, I got to get my baby hairs right. And I like to do little swirlies. Um, anything that's too long, I just tuck it under. And there you go, there you have it, my last hairstyle. This is super cute. All right, you guys, so that concludes this video. Uh, it was a little rough because I literally have no Nairobi left and my curls wanted to be extremely stubborn and not lay down today. But hopefully you guys got the gist of these hairstyles. If you would like uh, some more hair videos from me, maybe even more videos on how to do some head wrap styles go ahead and comment down below i want to thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in my next video bye